being the first province in the region to have an indigenous business council of their own, a concept that was born from the Indigenous Business Summit in Kokopo in 2012, the province welcomed Trade, Commerce and Industry Minister Richard Maru in colour and in style. Jiwaka currently has 420 SMEs and Minister Maru challenged them to double, if not triple, this number in the next 10 years. He said SMEs in the province will flourish when they have a vibrant voice to hear their concerns and handle all issues to do with business. He therefore called on the Jiwaka Indigenous Business Council to play its role in being the voice for small businesses. Indigenous Business Council, and by staff of an advocacy group to make sure that Nubla Indigenous SME plan block country, you know, by staff to make sure that the government implements the plan. It's a government plan, not Richard Maru's plan. Hold the government accountable and make sure we implement this plan. He then launched the Juwaka Indigenous Business Council. The council's 10-year corporate plan was also presented to the minister during the launch. Included in the plan are the council's strategies on how it will develop the SME sector in the province while identifying the industry in the province that will drive economic growth. Ruth Rungula. National MTV News.